Hi Sunnies, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, then welcome to my channel. It is day and today we are going thrift shopping. I wanted to go thrift shopping because I want to start doing thrift flips and just playing with clothes. And I decided to take you guys with me while I look for clothes. So, uh oh, I can't even open this door. So hopefully, I can find some good stuff to thrift flip. And today is Friday, so today everything is two dollars, and yeah, and they got hella clothes. So let's go ahead and get started. So I already found this. I went to the men's section, obviously because I have bigger clothes, and I wanted like a big sweater to make a two-piece set. And I'm kind of feeling this. So we're gonna keep this in hand just so nobody else will grab it, but. I'm gonna keep looking for like oversized sweaters and shirts and stuff to cut up at home. So this is another item I've taken a liking to. I really just like the color and I think this would be cute to make something out of. So I'm gonna hold on to this as well. This one is also really cool, just because of the color again. But again, I don't think I'm getting all of these. I'm just gonna hold them and make my decision at the end. And I kinda just go through really fast. This one's kinda cute, honestly. But it's a little dingy, so I'm not gonna get that one. Like the white part is dingy, so I'm just not gonna get that. Oh, this is a really nice color. I actually really like this. I love like neutral colors like browns and olives and stuff like that. But next I'm about to move on. Next I'm about to move on to like the t-shirts because summer is coming up so I don't really need like a lot of sweaters and stuff because it's gonna be hot anyway. So I'm in the men's section. Okay, I look a little crazy. I actually like I got in a fight over these clothes, but these are the clothes I got. And now I'm about to determine which ones I really, really want and check out. So this is all the clothes that I purchased. It's quite a lot and I won't have to come back for a while. And it's all play clothes. So it's about, I'm gonna give you all the total after I leave here. It was so loud in there. I could barely talk over the music and all the ladies like speaking Spanish or whatever, like super loud. So my total was $32. It was 31.80, so $32. And I got all this stuff right here. I am going to like wash it, then wash it again, and then wash it again. Like, ugh, their stores are so dirty, but so good. The only problem is, well, it's not a problem, but the realization is I need to start coming on Wednesdays instead of Saturday. Saturdays is $2, which is not horrible, but on Wednesday you get it for 25 cents. And these are play clothes, so I wanna start learning how to create clothes and make clothes. So these are all just like play clothes and stuff for me to like cut up and just transform and flip it and see what I can do and everything. I'm about to get a sewing machine. I was just in Walmart, which is the craziest thing. But you know when you go on a store and you didn't really like make a list and you have like other things to get, you kind of just forget. So I didn't go in there specifically for the sewing machine, so I forgot to go look at the sewing machines. But I'm going to look at some prices and I should be getting a sewing machine really soon because I want to learn how to sew and make like sets and stuff. So I just got all these clothes to play with and I probably won't have to come back to the thrift store for a good, good, good minute because I got a lot of clothes to play with. So yeah. But that about wraps it up. When I get to the house, I'm going to show you guys what all I got and do like a thrift store haul for you guys. I'm not going to try it on like ill, but I'll just like hold it up and show you what I got and like my vision for it. So I'll see you guys when I get home. As you can see, it's been a couple of days. Like I don't even look the same. So I went to the thrift store on Saturday and today is Wednesday. So I have my bag here of everything that I bought. 
them and show you guys kind of like an idea of what I wanted to do with them in my head when I picked them up. I also, I'll wait for it. I also bought this sewing machine the other day. Um, it was a little pricey, but it was cheaper than all the rest of the sewing machines. So I've read about this sewing machine and it has like really good reviews. So I bought this sewing machine in the hopes of like really, really trying to get serious and learn how to sew. And this is what it looks like. It has like really good reviews. I also just bought some, um, also just bought this kit from Amazon. I freaking love Amazon. But I bought this kit and it has like, it's a whole like 30 thread set, um, measuring, pins, all of that. So um, pretty much next week, I'm gonna start learning how to sew because I really, really want to learn. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into these clothes. First, I got this really pretty sweater. I love the color of it, like so pretty. And I'm thinking about turning this into like some type of two-piece set. And I'm thinking like a crop. Ew, I haven't washed these yet. I don't know why I'm putting this on my body. But like some type of like crop top and then maybe some shorts or a skirt with this. And I'm gonna put them on the floor because I'm about to wash them like three times. Because I like they've been at the thrift store and that's just gross, so. Next, this one. I got this one because I was inspired by this girl um, on TikTok. She made a three-piece set out of like an oversized dress. This one is velvet and it's like purple and I love it. So if I can recreate that set, then that is what this is for. Really cute. Next is this. And I'm also thinking about making this either a two-piece set or like maybe um, a dress because of the zipper and stuff. Maybe like some type of like sweater dress and maybe play with the sides a little bit here. So this is what this looks like. And everything again was $2. So I only spent 32 and I actually really don't need to go back to the thrift store. I wanted to go to Play-Dohs, but I'm gonna um, play with these first. Now this one, I might just wear this one as is. It says Earth Without Art is eh. And I really like it. It's orange and it's tie-dye. And I might wear it like this or I might like cut the front and distress it or something. I don't know. That one doesn't even need sewing. Next is this little t-shirt, this oversized men's t-shirt. It's green. I was trying to use this for my St. Patrick's Day outfit, but I don't know if my kit will be here before St. Patrick's Day, so hopefully. But my hopes with this of making like some biker shorts and like a crop top, because I'm not gonna hold it up completely up to me, but it's pretty freaking big. So I'm hoping like some little biker shorts and some type of like top I can make with that and then put like some bedazzled if I do use it for St. Patrick's Day, I use some bedazzle to make like a, um, a four leaf clover or something. Just really cute, just something really cute. And if I do do that, I'm going to record it for you guys so we can see how it turns out. And then I also got this button up. And y'all may think I'm crazy because it's actually like, it's about to be spring, it's about to be summer, but I want to play with these and learn how to do them. So next time winter comes around, or fall or whatever, I'll have these cute sets already. So I love this color. It's a little like lint on there or something. But I love this color and it's really soft and it feels like really heavy. So that's that. And that's probably gonna be another two piece set. So really I, the goal was to get a bunch of sweaters so that I could practice making a bunch of two piece sets. So. And I got this sweater, I absolutely love it. I love like neutral colors and this turtleneck and this will probably be cut like there and some type of like two piece set. But I'm going to leave the crop top part kind of like oh, like flowy, like um, oversized this is the word I'm looking for. And then I got this really pretty, it's really pretty blue, just sweater and 
because I have so many two-piece sets, I don't know. I can kind of see this as a two-piece set and then like flip this and make this part, this part the skirt or whatever, but we gonna see. So I have that. Um, and then, okay, this is the last one. I know y'all think all I bought was like sweaters, but this is the last one. I just thought this would be so fun to try to make into some fuzzy like pajama, like the pajama set or like lounge set in the unicorn. I could see me wearing this in the house. Like this is so me, like some shorts and like a jacket or whatever. Okay, now, now that all the sweaters are done, let me show y'all what else I got. I got this like dad shirt. I love the color, like the orange and the white stripes. Love it. And it's a collar shirt. And I'm thinking about maybe making this some sort of two piece, or I'm just gonna take this fabric and use it. I'm gonna take this shirt and use it as fabric and make different kinds of shirts. And you'll see what I'm talking about. For this, or for this shirt. Okay, next is, I love this color, like lilac right now is my favorite color. So it's like this beautiful lavender lilac color. It's turtleneck and I honestly just might wear this as is or I might like take it in some, but I like the oversized look in this shirt. Like it's just really cute to me. Next, I got this kind of like cream like egg eggshell turtleneck i just like turtlenecks so i might keep this one as is as well and not cut that one up this one's a little bit more fun i got this like baby blue it's like a two-piece set it's a skirt and then the jacket now this i'm gonna have some fun with and i probably make like um the skirt's long, so I'll probably do a three-piece. If I can make a top out of the bottom, have a short skirt, and then maybe crop this just a little bit so it can be like a crop blazer, then yeah, that's my goals for this outfit. And it's so cute. Like, just look at that. It has like little stripes. It's just, it's really cute. And then I have another one like this. And it's this green color. Oh my gosh, I love this. I love, 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 love this. So I have this jacket and it came with this dress to work with. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna be using this to make something real cute, like some type of set. And lastly, lastly, I have this and I love the material and the colors like champagne like it has like a shimmer to it I know y'all can't really see it but like a shimmer and this freaking detailing in the front like I love that so definitely gonna make some type of top just out of this part right here because why would I not like yeah like that's so cute to me but yeah that's everything that is everything I got from the thrift store and I'm so happy about my sewing machine. And this year I'm just trying to learn everything I can and really just test my own limitations and really just try to do new things because I have always wanted to make clothes and stuff, but I feel like my, um, my mom didn't really like nurture like my hobbies and stuff like that. So I'm starting now, like at my big age, I'm starting now and you're never too old to learn something. So I'm excited. I'm very excited. And I'm hoping by next year, like I could have sewing down pat. Like, yeah, that's everything I bought from the thrift store. And I hope you guys enjoy going with me. I won't be going anytime soon until I like pretty much use these clothes first. And these are all just like play clothes mostly. So I probably won't be going for like a while, a while. So I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, and turn your post notification bells on. I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you guys.